Hi, this is Danny from Cradle of Filth. I'm here at Comic Con in London, and this is what's in my bag. First thing I bought, <laughs> it's a poor substitute for Kenneth Williams, which is ideally what I wanted. I came to Comic Con and I bought an autograph of Kenneth Williams, but I didn't. Uh, but this is equally as good. This is Caroline Munro from, I think, Dracula 1972. Dracula AD 1972, sorry. Um, with Christopher Lee and what I thought was a bit of blood on it is actually probably a titty picture of her just to the side there. She used to do all that sort of stuff anyway but it looks good and it's going to go on my autograph wall which is all black and white stuff anyway so it'll fit in very nicely and she wrote it in, in, in blue but which I think it's a good find. Not very really comic conish, but sort of. Williams. Oh, the guy, the fat guy from Hobbit, Samwise. Uh, secondly, this was a bargain. A Cthulhu uh, tribute box. Oh no, I didn't want that. <laughs> I'll have to take that back. That's not what I wanted at all. <laughs> um, which is a bargain because it was eight quid. It was 11, so that would have brought us out. That's, see what I mean? I, I thought that was going to be perfect on the mark for my budget. But it was actually uh, three quid cheaper. Which meant I got this. <laughs> Uh, third leap, this, which is, I'm going to put that next to my computer because uh, that's pretty much how I feel most of the time and probably how my computer feels as well about anything in life. I'm not again, he's turned me on. Uh, which is actually a weeping angel from Doctor Who. And it's actually the uh, album cover for Discharge, uh, last album, which uh, obviously they've been very cheap and just nicked it, a photocopy version of something out of uh, the TV Times. But that, I think that's pretty cool. It's like a trophy, isn't it? For the best crier. <laughs> And last but not least, I actually said that I was never ever going to buy any of these and then I got a load for my birthday. And not even in sequence, there was like a Star Wars one, one from something else, uh, the Avengers or something like that. Um, which means that it's a slippery slope to uh, bankruptcy right there. But I thought I'd get Pinhead because obviously I'm good friends with Doug Bradley. Who uh, is a lot bigger than this in real life. His head's not quite so deformed. Not quite. Pain has a face. Allow me to show it to you. Gentlemen. I am pain. So yeah, yeah, a fitting tribute. Yeah, that's cool. I mean, he's not even going to collect that. That's going to come straight out of the box, which I never usually do with toys. I've got an attic full of, of, of toys that are in boxes for, um, for the apocalypse so I can sell them. 
at a, an extortionate rate. Um, I could probably open a stall here actually. I should do that next year. I'll have to get a word with the guy that runs the place. There we go, that's what I bought.